Here comes the Hainster, man. Ready to go? This little, uh, piece of history. The Chuck Kyle Murray is what he is. So, Keith Haney coming up here, uh, one of the owners of the Tulsa Drag Strip down in Tulsa, and uh, so good to see him out here enjoying the Pro Nitrous this weekend. Been quiet over there, hasn't it? I haven't seen him up there. He doesn't have his little, uh, Beach blowhorn out there making call outs in the pit area. And, <laughs> hey, you, come over here. Yeah, <laughs> look at me, the guy on two milk cartons. <laughs> <laughs> and that puts him in advertise. A great, great guy, uh, very creative. He came out this year with a couple of cars that are pretty significant in the overall picture of things. And yeah. A great guy. No, 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 no. So, I mean, he's good for the sport. And I love the name of the cars. I mean, these are cars which everybody should. Uh, just to give you know, the fans that, you know, the feeling that they can get behind something other than just a Camaro or a Mustang or, you know, a Duster or whatever it be. They get behind the name of the car. So he's got himself coming up there, Brandon Schweitzer, who does all the nitrous tuning. And Mr. Brandon Pez, the chassis tuner down there, helps out with Cap Haney and does all the great thing. All seven of his dealerships help sponsor this Broken Arrow, Arrow Oklahoma-based uh, Chevrolet Camaro. So keep hanging right here, and uh, I was trying to get down there. What's he got? Uh, also, every name of every dealership down there. And I mean, he sells everything. Suburban Chevys, GMCs, Warwicks, uh, Hyundais, Nissan, Mitsubishi. Man, he's got a a bunch more. He's got a pick for anybody down there. So here we go. He got back out of it right away there. 1.005 60 foot time, and then it, uh, the split is about where it all said good night, 286. So Keith Haney will go back to the drawing board in the number 10 spot in qualifying, the 496.6 at 105 miles per hour. Utilizing the track well. A legit 903. All right, so here we go. We get the old clear. Let's go back to Pro Nitrous Racing. Old school, new school. Chevrolets. Engines come to life and Keith Haney's going to pull into Triple A Auto Insurance side of the racetrack with that wild looking Chevrolet New School Camaro. Man oh man. Oh man. And another oh man. As uh, Rini goes down there to Carmel, New York, on his burn out the left lane, I was just going to say, you know, he, he put on Facebook, what do you think of the black and red? I was one of the first to see that. Not that I wanted to be, and I said, leave it alone. The car's beautiful. You black know, and red. And, and it is. I mean, and I've yeah. seen a lot of black cars here today, but something about the striping that, on that car that really just brings it out. Black, white, and red. I mean, that's... Uh, I don't know how many times Brian Olson and I talked about that when we were getting ready to repaint the drag He said black, white, and red. We're gonna. That's what we're gonna go with. And by God, that's what we did. And you got know, a lot it, of compliments. It, it looks good. That's right. Yep. Maybe throw a little, a little purple up there. Yeah, purple so never hurt anybody. Highlight. Yep. Yeah. Just a little highlight. It brings it together. It sure does. Pulls it all together. So Keith Haney and Chris Rainey, number 13 and number six in qualifying. Rainey has that ATI Profab machine. Of course, Charlie Buck providing the horsepower there at 903 cubic inches strong. True to the school right there as uh, Carl was talking about, the ATI car. And Rini has definitely been a poster boy for that team and that company for many, many years and religiously and uh, do doing them well. Charlie Buck, the same. They've been there. They've built him power, and this guy really knows how to get that package utilized. So keep your eye on him. Right side, it's going to be the car salesman, the dealership, and you might as well say the mega dealership owner because he's got one of every brand, it seems like. And if Pontiac was still in business, he'd have them. He snuggled inside of the car seat and ready to go. Oklahoma right side. New York right side. Out of the gate. Flat best run of the weekend for Haney of the Buck 97. And Rini's car went nowhere. Very nice run right there. It's Rini just coast down there, and uh, he'll still stay number seven. And uh, the upsetting part about that is Haney got above him on qualifying with that run. So Haney goes right up on the number six spot. 390 with a one, and 90 with a five was Rini's previous run in round number one of qualifying in Pro Nitrous. Brought to you by Schweitzer Dynamics for all your nitrous needs. 
Now starting up on the starting line. Oh, and it's him. You know my name. You know my game. The car dealer from Broken Arrow, Oklahoma. This is Keith Haney. For Haney, it's rare motors and horsepower under the hood. He's got Brandon Pez on the chassis. He's got Brandon Schweitzer on the tune. This is an all-star lineup, folks. He's number 12 in the field, 390 with a 1, 197 for speed. And he's got some work to do. He doesn't like being in the back half of the field. Number 12 is not where you want to be. He needs to go better than a 384 to get into the top half. And if I know Keith Haney, number eight is not his target. What is the, the name of that car again? Do you know? Um, sheesh. I know it's one of them names. I don't remember. Uh, you know, I'm terrible about that kind of stuff. No, I was just curious. The other one was Enigma. Enigma. And, and this uh, one's like Notorious. Notorious? Yeah, Notorious Under Pressure is what it says on there. Notorious Under Pressure. Yeah. See that? It's got a... Uh, it's a theme. He's, he's a very creative gentleman. That's all I'm going to tell you. Yeah, Notorious Enigma. Wow. This guy's got nine dealerships, Al. He's partners in nine different... It says seven here, but I know for a fact he's got two more than that. Enigma, there it is. They got a great shot. Thank you to the quarterback starting line camera. William Lewis and Bauer, David Ruler in the house this weekend. It was so nice to see him out there. And see Notorious right there, it says. Notorious under pressure. Notorious two under pressure. L-J-R-C. Larry, do you have a race car? The builder of this race car, 948. William Lewis under the hood. Notorious. Yeah. That is. Three eighty one with a two at two hundred miles an hour for Keith Haney. Quarter max stop end zone, and it's the one the only notorious. That's right, I don't remember his name, but somebody remembered his name. Oh, that's Keith Haney, that's right. Not bad, man. Going number five. Uh, number five is good right there. I mean, uh considering there's my boy right there. Uh considering uh you know, we didn't have any data for the last two runs. We lost a race pack, so we made the first two hits. <laughs> didn't even know. I mean, I don't even know what Brandon put in there, but I think we went 81, but it was all over the track. You know, it was a it was a good pass. I'm um, looking forward to I wanted to go number one. Exactly. But you know what? With no data, what can you do? Exactly. So we're ready for tomorrow. That's what's good. What do you think? What do you think? You approve? Does it approve? Yep. There you have it. All right. <laughs> Keep your eyes out. Oh, notorious tomorrow for the final qualifying session. All the seven dealerships putting him in this seat of this car right here. The 2015 Chevrolet Camaro rear motorcycle power, 948 cubes. Really done him good. Beanie now uh, checking out there where everyone else was uh, putting the power on. Schweitzer, Dynamics doing the tuning on there uh, in the nitrous oxide. Pez also being a crew chief on this car. Lucas Oil Racing Junk. Helping out all the dealerships uh, from Suburban Chevrolet, uh, Miami, Buick, GMC, Nissan of uh, us. Uh, no one guessed that name. And the original Hyundai, Green County, Mitsubishi, the Nissan of Asuka C. All right, Asuka C. I remember her. I remember going to prom in a canoe with Pocahontas, too. with nitrous outlet it's a musi car a musi power plant in the bickle chassis and we're morrison at david's green 948 cubic inch big block chevrolet and the keith haney entry and Schweitzer dynamics and brandon pez tuning the chassis 
And uh, Brandon Schweitzer doing all the nitrous work. Lucas Oil Racing Junk and all those dealerships. And he's got a bunch of them. I like how he says, all my dealerships and his associated partners. Bring them to life. Number five in qualifying. The glued to the television screens back at home because, man, he's made a name for himself in the sport of drag racing this year. Keith Haney. Under pressure. There it is. You know my name. Now watch his game as he gets ready. Go purge down and do everything he has to do. Left side, you've got a big, big purge down there for the Missouri Base Racing Team and their Mercy Power. They're looking over. They're saying, yeah, we're all ready. Jimmy, a great driver, too. Number 12 in qualifying, Jimmy Lisa, the owner of the Flying A Motorsports Team. Total Larry Jeffers chassis going against the Bickle. Busey versus Rear and Morrison. Top bulbs are lit. And Haney, the last one in the game. My stop end zone, Pro Nitrous, Keith Haney. I mean, you know my name. I'm mean, notorious. I mean, your son's actually here, and you're moving on to round number two. First time on the road. Well, you know what? We've been, you know, we've had a, the last four races have been really good. So we made it to semis in Rockingham. Looking forward to going to the finals this one. Got my son with me. It's his first time to actually go out of town. You know, got my wife and my kids at home watching it online right now. And great sponsors. And what a crew I got going on. It's Brandon Schweitzer and Brandon Pez, Rear Morrison Power. We're ready to roll it up. That was that one got out there a little wirely out there, but we did all right. That's right. Keep your eyes on Brandon Squares. They're going to get Keith Haney ready to rock and roll for round number two. We gotta send our security up to the starting line, please. All right, off the starting line. If you're not with the race team, you need to remove yourself off the starting line immediately. Security is on their way in the cotton mouth. Here we go. Keith Haney on the right side. Big race here. Jay Cox, Keith Haney been going after it for a couple of years now in the PDRA, haven't they? Oh, man, they've been doing it out on Facebook all winter long. And I'll tell you what, this is the one they've been waiting for right here in Texas. Here you go. Keith Haney backs up. He's got himself the you know me car back there on the right side of the Air, Oklahoma. Jay Cox, you know, you go back and you tell a little story about the guy from Smithfield, North Carolina. Got a new baby on the way. All the things were going to be number two for the family. He's got competitors. He sure is. I'll tell you what, Jay Cox, a great guy, youngster, 31 years of age, Bryant Industrial Crane and Rigging on board. Brian, one of the greatest guys here. I'm telling you, he's a fun fella. But you know what? So's Haney. He's full of it. He's full of it up to here, Al. And this guy likes to race. He don't really care. He's just going to hang it out and let it go. 40, 30 years of fun sitting over there on the right side, whether it's on a film deck or not. It's done. Keith Haney, ready to make it happen out of Broken Arrow. Owner of Tulsa Raceway Park, along with Todd and all the guys down there and the gals to make it happen. The number five and third qualifier. Getting ready to make it happen here in the flight through dynamics third and nitrous category. Thank you. 